Quack Quack, and we're back. That was painless, wasn't it? See, there you go. Music is too loud for babies. Just turn it down a tiny little bit and everything will be fine. Also, if you're having any issues with the quality of the stream, it might look bad, and that's potentially because at the moment we have transcoding options. So if you're on, if you're able to change it from medium all the way up to source, or if you're having problems with it buffering, you're able to go from medium down to low or even mobile quality. But who the hell wants to watch a stream in mobile quality? Not even people on their mobiles want to watch stream in uh, mobile quality. You're in a minivan at the moment. What, are you, are you driving it or are you being driven somewhere? If you're driving, please put the phone down and focus on the road, but I'm guessing you're not driving if you're on the phone. After camp... <laughs> oh, Jimmy, you've gone camping. That sounds cool. Do you have photos to share? Guys, gotta go. Sorry, be on in 15 minutes. Okay, we'll see you later, Canada. Good night, Waffles. Um, this doesn't really look like a portrait of a loser, does it? No, he's got to make her look slightly less happy. She's too happy at the moment. Yeah, the problem is they were talking because he was too miserable to do a painting because his social needs were so low. So they had a little bit of a chat. But we need her to look bad. Okay, so if you guys don't know what the hell's going on here, we're doing Sims. We're doing... If you ever heard of Big Brother, what we're doing is we are... Uh, Doing basically the same thing, but oh goddamn, she's not looking. Come on, she's sniffing her armpit because she stinks. <laughs> no, she's doing lean and dab. That's what she's doing. So basically, it's a social experiment where we see who's the least popular after three days, and then they get sent down to the basement where the painting gimp paints them, and we then wait for them to starve to death. And if Bermuda goes and checks up upstairs now, you'll be able to see the uh, graves. Of some of, the, of some of the sims that have not been able to make it. Oh, there There's we go. There's a sad this face. This is the kind of picture we want. Good girl. Thank you all the people that came with the Phase Changer Raid. If you want to sit around for a while and enjoy the ducks, everything will be cool. Yep. If you want to lurk, that's fine. Um, if you're liking what you see, please remember to follow this channel. Yeah. We'd love you ever so much if you did. <laughs> And yeah, here are all the graves. Uh, this is the 13th season, so, you know, there are seven people in each season, six of whom die every season. So, yeah, 72 graves out here. <laughs> Angel of Love, welcome to the Duck Pond, Mother Ducker. Thank you very much for following me. You are a newest Mother Ducker. Come in and cool yourself in the nice cooling waters of the Duck Pond. Hear that quacking in chat, that's the other ducks welcoming you in. You hungry breadcrumbs to the face. How's this game now? I remember there were a lot of complaints for downgrading the game from The Sims 3. Okay, so... Valid question. Kind of, it, yeah, it's kind of like a downgrade, but kind of an upgrade. So, the it's a downgrade because there's a hell of a lot less stuff in it now. And a hell of a lot less capability to do things. Uh, the biggest thing in Sims 3 was you'd be able to recolor literally anything with any sets of colors you wanted. I and love it made that. the game it made the game look more vibrant and made you be able to have nice color choices and things like that. But now you can't do any of that. You've got like a very limited color choice of like a palette of things. Uh, so that's kind of rubbish. And also they don't have all the packs that came with Sims 3, so when but those to, will like, come, of course. Yeah. They're slowly coming out. Uh, it's just basically a money grab, but the the biggest thing was uh, you're able to... In Sims 3, everywhere was loaded at once. Yeah, you so, could walk to any part of yeah. the neighborhood. So it's kind of good, but kind of bad in the fact that it made it incredibly laggy after you made a, like more than like one house's worth of things. So if you ever wanted to go anywhere, it would load it up and you'd be able to, uh, because you didn't install the colour pass. Oh yeah, of course, yeah, that's how it works, shape <laughs> face. <laughs> no price of only £600! Oh no! Yeah, gotta keep keep that stuff all the same colour. <laughs> per you. you. Shit! <laughs> so yeah, like... So that's a bit rubbish, but it's definitely an upgrade in the fact that, like, it now runs everyone's faster. really, really smooth and it's nice and... Better optimized. Yeah, definitely better optimization. 
And they've done sort of like a midway between like Sims 3 and Sims 2 where like in The Sims 2 anytime you went to another house or another lot you had to go through a loading screen but in The Sims 3 you didn't have the loading screen because literally everything was loaded which did slow you down but at least you didn't have a loading screen but here it's like from your house like the nearby lots are loaded but the farther ones you do have to go through a loading screen so it's kind of like half and half so that's all right. It's a compromise. I think it's a good compromise, though. It definitely yeah. makes the game run better. Yeah. So you can literally like go to your next door neighbor without having to go through a loading screen, but um, but yeah, any further than that, you do have to go through a loading screen, which is fine because yeah, having everything loaded at once really did. I played The Sims Three with many expansion packs, not all of them, but many of them, and it was really slow. Hmm. Uh, someone else asked this question about what, what we do with the people once they're through the house. Well, they get moved to the big brother Victor's house, uh, which is the, we've kind of got one across the street at the moment. This is a lovely place where they get uh, the one person of every house gets to uh, live out their dream. Okay, she, someone... Where the hell is she going? Yeah, this is one of our... Wait, is she here? There's two of her? Are there... What's going on? That's how, her! How many drugs have we taken? Why are there two of these There's people two here? two of them. What? Aliens, everyone. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna get that floor tile expansion. Right? Yeah, I mean, there's, there's... I think there's three different types of things. There's, like, expansion packs, game item packs, and uh, something else, right? Or is it, like... Yeah, there's, it's like kind of like a mini expansion pack. I'm not sure what they call it, but like we have the outdoor one, and that's kind of like a mini expansion pack. Because it's more than a stuff pack, but less than an expansion. Are you going to wait until you come home so you can see us in a bit? Okay, see you later, Jimmy. I okay. hope you get back to your homeless home uh, when you uh, <laughs> be able to see us again. Your master plan is working, Tim. What, are you cloning oh. people and putting them back into our game? God damn it, Tim! Uh, Tim did ask earlier before uh, Phase Changer asked about you know Sims 4 being a downgrade from The Sims 3, but Tim did ask what was the original intent for this social experiment that we're doing. Um, it's less maybe of an experiment and more of a method of getting follower Sims out into our Sim you know universe, but not all of them because there are just too many yeah you can see i mean there's 72 graves out here we can't put them all we can't put all of the follower sims in the neighborhood so this is our method of just choosing the best or the most popular or yeah you know, it's kind the... of like it's kind of like some form of racial profile <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, I don't think it's got anything to do with race. Don't, but... I don't mean racial profiling. I'm <laughs> completely joking. There. What's the? What do they call it again? Um... Discrimination. It's not, it's not. It's not euthanasia. It's the other word that's horrendous and related to the Nazis. Uh, eugenics. Eugenics. Yeah, it's like eugenics of popularity, like popularity eugenics. Ah, uh, Tim. I knew it. Yeah, Tim's the one who's cloning the Sims. The, the important thing to remember is even if a person's sim dies in Big Brother's Bloody Basement, they still exist in our gallery, so, you know, they could they could be brought back. And in some cases they have been, yeah. right? Beauty died in Big Brother's Bloody Basement, but his sim now lives in the mod house because he became a mod in our channel, and we have a household full of, like, the sims of our channel mods, so once he was made mod, we basically resurrected him from the dead and <laughs> put him in here. Let's find let's find his actually. Yeah, that's him. He died in season go. two. But he lives on. Also Pirate Kitty died. Yep. Uh unintentionally. She died of hysteria. And we still see there's her gravestone. She's not supposed to the winner isn't supposed to have a gravestone. Mm-hmm. <laughs> But she totally does, because she accidentally died. That was a real... That was a twist. See you later, Jin. Thank you for the host. Thank you for stopping yeah. by. See you for when you do Doom later. Basically, you're doing your best to implement more ways for viewers to interact with the stream. You could yes. say that, Tim. That's a very good because way to say that. All, all of the people in the house right now, other than the gimp, uh, is... Well, they, they're all... 
viewers. like followers and viewers mm. that have followed and asked to be made into Sims. But we can't put them all into our world, so we do this. Yeah, and then it's a fun way that we do actually get to see their sim. They do actually get to make an appearance in the stream, and it goes up onto YouTube, so it's immortalized there. So yeah, your sim, you know, does get to do something, even if it means they die in the end. I think you just missed him, sadly, Titania. Uh, most, like, a few of the people that are our mods here, other than a, a few people and some other people that aren't our mods, are a member of our like unofficial stream team that we've been trying to get going. And uh, you can see all the stuff about that on our website if you're interested in checking that out. Uh, we try to make a place where we can like get everyone out there and do things with some of the other streamers, part of the uh, the Sunny Ducks flock, and. Uh, Titania is one of the members, so she generally comes around and hosts us a lot and stuff, and when we do eventually get partnered, we're going to try and make it into an official stream team and bring everyone along with us. Also, hello Enzo 2G Games. Enzo? You try and say that better than me. Uh, Enzo Games? It's Dutch. Oh, okay. Hello. Welcome, uh, congratulations on your first day, uh, well, second day of being part of Twitch and Zootia. How are you doing today? Are you a Sims player yourself? Well, I did her name wrong and there's no way to change the name of a painting. Oh. Fuck me. <laughs> it's fine. It doesn't matter. It does matter, but it doesn't. Alright, she's the first one on the wall. Emma Smith, 101. Look at that sad quote. Faze, you really, really love that baby rage remote, don't you? <laughs> I, try and, <laughs> I try and put like a happy smiley face, a sad face, or a tongue acty face at pretty much at the end of mine, but you really love that baby rage. <laughs> Is that uh, is that a meme in your channel to use the baby rage a lot or? I didn't see it very much when I was there last. I have figured out a way to copy The Sims using the photos on a nanogenetic level. Wahaha! <laughs> no, you don't. <laughs> yes, lol. <laughs> Guys, pay attention. This girl is about to kick the bucket. Who caked the bucket? Oh god. You did manage to take a, a painting of her though, right? Yep. Yep. And I named it wrong and put it on the wall. Oh, you put it on the wall even with the name mm -hmm. wrong name. Okay. Yeah, I, I can't change the name, so... Oof. At least the gravestone will have the correct name, so there's that. You say you play on baby or toddler difficulty? Uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you mean you play Dark Souls on baby or toddler difficulty? That's a difficult game, isn't it? So uh, Did you actually play it on like, easy mode then? Because I play generally uh, most things normal. I've done some Fallout 4 on um, like the beta survival version. And that's pretty damn hard and really, really irritating as balls to play. Oh god, some of them are eating. Well, I think it only really makes a few hours of difference, to be honest. There's no easy mode, other than other than being a, a, uh, a mage, right? Did you guys get my form, Angel of Love? Are you, uh, you mean to be made into a sim, or let me have a quick look, what, what, what do you mean? Guys, stop eating! Stop eating. Alright, she has been reaped. Her urn is there. Let's put that out in the yard. Emma Smith 101, rip. Time to see who's the next to get sent to the basement. Oh, I can't talk about how old my sandwiches are. Tim Sandwich. 
Um, what form are you talking about, Angel of Love? Oh, yes, we have in fact got your form. It's got on the 24th of last month. Hey, Ali Cat, how you doing? Good morning. Hi, Did I miss my sim perish? No, your sim was not in this one. I'm not sure if you're in an earlier one, though. I don't think so. I feel like that name was in the sim. We had like a lot of cats, though. So yeah, a lot might of cat-related people. Let me just check. We have currently not made you yet, Angel of Love. Uh, we generally try to make people when they're around. So... We didn't Alley yet. Cat, there you are. You you died last season, season 12, um, but mm -hmm. you made it to the second half, so you did well. Congratulations. Is that up on our YouTube yet? Let me double check. I don't think it is. I don't think it's been released yet. Uh, 14 is the one, so that would be... If we're on season 13 now, so yeah, no, fifth, number 15 should be our season... 13. Should be this one, yeah. The one oh, sorry, that, that means it has been released then, it's 14. Or do really? you mean it hasn't actually been up yet? I don't think it's been released. Like, I think it's on YouTube, but I don't think it's public, is what oh, I mean. Oh, yeah, you're right, you're right. It says it's private at the moment. So it'll be coming up soon. It's only a two-parter, apparently. Unless we haven't finished uploading all of them. You're eating cheese food right now. Oh, Chinese, Chinese food. food. <laughs> wow. Cheese food. Wow. Okay, so back in the day, there were these things called Lunchables. Do you ever have Lunchables? They're yeah, horrendous. They're, they're, like, they're really they're like bad. Squares of fake cheese and like really cruddy biscuits and maybe some like goo or some meat that's not even meat that goes with it. Oh, I read the back of one of those Lunchables once and it says, yeah, like. Cheese foods. It doesn't say it's cheese. It says it's cheese foods. Yeah, like cheese so food take product that, or something. Take them that as you will. What the hell you think it actually is? Yes, you fought the good fight, Tally Cat. Eating Chinese food. Oh, I like some Chinese food. I used to work at a Chinese restaurant uh, for quite some time in my youth. And I am a gigantic, tall English man. And people were like, oh, ah, ha, 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 I'm so funny. You are, you're, the, you're the tallest Chinese person I've ever seen. Ha, 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 ha. It's, it's horrendous. You don't have to be Chinese to work in a I know. Chinese restaurant. So what are they saying that you're a I Chinese know. person? <laughs> Because because they're stupid and they think they're th funny. Yeah. I've got some bad news. What? OP, OP is the voted. next person to go. Oh, well, there we go. I'm sorry, everyone. But uh, OP Loaf, the uh, person that we, that we most know in this house, has to go down into Big Brother's bloody basement to yeah. be the next person. OP has done lots and lots and lots of fan art for this channel and, uh, I must say, is a gorgeous sim as well. But that doesn't that doesn't equal a survivor, I'm I'm afraid. You said you played Uncharted on baby mode, but you played it on hard mode. Oh okay, nice, nice face. Uncharted. Yeah, it's a PS4 game. It's kind of like uh What the hell's it called? Oh god. Uh Tomb Raider, oh. but it's a dude. Uh, what what happens if like the goblin Drake gets something. voted off? Uh, yeah, the, I, I realise that is a joke because you put the camera cap at the end of there, but he cannot get voted off. He is always the most popular person in the house. He has so many ghost votes. Yeah, yeah, he knows a lot of ghosts, so there's no way he can ever get voted off. OP, let's just try to see, you know, what kind of traits OP had that might have made her not very popular. Yeah, theoretically, uh, theoretically, those things have inspired each other because Tomb Raider stopped being a game and, you know, people stopped playing it and it just didn't get made for ages and ages and ages after the original ones. 
And then it came back and would kind of like use some of the techniques that uh, that Uncharted used when they made the new like Tomb Raider and now the new Rise of Tomb Raider. Yeah, here we go. Tomb Raider was first, then Uncharted, then the reboot of Tomb Raider inspired Uncharted 1 to 3, and then Uncharted 4 is inspired by the latest Tomb Raider. Exactly. That's basically what he said, but you uh-huh. said much more detail. Thank you very much, Faze. I've just, I'm not, oh, I've yeah, never was, heard of Uncharted. This is what I was going to say, like, Faze, you did, or are doing, a degree in chemistry, right? You are? Sorry. I think he said he's, he has done it, and then maybe going on to do a Masters, I can't quite quite remember. But I think he said it was like material chemistry or something. I've, I've completely forgotten exactly what it was. But the Muda has also done a degree in chemistry, so you should get along like a house on fire. When my guy turns up, you won't really need to see what made him unpopular. <laughs> and hello, Slayer Darth. Yeah, you just finished your master's in chemistry? Congratulations. Yeah, it was it's in chemistry. Uh. Phil, were you that dickest waiter in the Chinese restaurant that spoke to people in Cantonese fucking slayers? No, I believe Maybe it's Connor that speaks. Thursday. Connor speaks Cantonese. Antimicrobial silver wool. Oh, cool, nice. Well, it's silver particles, silver nanoparticles are used in things like. You can drink them too, apparently, and people say there's health benefits to drinking, like nanoparticles of silver but if you drink it too much you'll turn blue well yeah well, you don't want to do that it, it doesn't hurt you but yeah there are people with blue skin that drink like silver nanoparticles and it makes their skin blue unfortunately it's permanently restricted in our guide for two year embargo on top of that I'd show, otherwise that I'd show you yeah you'd imagine it would work on both your good and bacteri- bad gut bacteria so that'd be pretty shitty yeah. It's not toxic, but it causes blueness, yeah. Unlike cyanide, which causes blueness and is very toxic. Yeah. But that gets in the way of your ATP uh, like creation, which is why it kills you almost instantly. Mm. Yeah. If you're going to poison yourself to death, I recommend cyanide. Don't... You're literally nope. dying, Oliver? Oh no. It's 27 degrees in his room. That is not pleasant. Fuck... No. Fuck summer. I'm serious, have you, guys. Have you got, like, some hella, like, computer fans going on there that's, like, burning you to death or something? I think it's just hot in Hungary. I mean, it's just... It's basically hot almost everywhere in the world. It's only a few places in the world that are, like, at tolerable temperatures, in my opinion. It's hard to get... It's hard to get cyanide? I think you can extract it from peach pits. I'll just sniff NMR solvents. I did a lot of NMR in my day. It was a long yeah, it was a long time ago though. But I remember like cracking those little glass ampules of the NMR solvents and like the warnings on those things. <laughs> It's like fucking, you know, some serious warnings, and I'm like, oh, please don't spill it on myself. It's probably not that bad if you do spill it on yourself, to be honest. Super hot in NZ, uh, no apparent reason. I mean, it was, uh, except for today, it was cold. Oh. Summer's your birthday, Angel of Love. Nice. Summer is my birthday. <laughs> the entire of summer. I, uh, what did you do your masters in Bastion? Huh? Huh? No. I did mine at Imperial. Phase Changer asks, what do you do now? I'm guessing you're asking me, what do I do now for a living? The answer is, whatever pays the bills. I'm basically a <laughs> prostitute. She isn't actually a prostitute. Though. I do whatever I need to do for the money. Uh, I'm currently working as a cashier. Yeah. And I did my degree in uh, genetics, and I am currently working as a lab assistant in a secondary school, which to you is a, I don't know, place before university, so like college level school kind of thing. Oh. Minecart Gaming One, welcome to the Duck Pond, Mother Ducker. Thank you for following you, our newest Mother Ducker. Come in and cool yourself off in the cold waters of the Duck Pond. You hear that cracking chat? That's your ducks welcoming you in. You hungry? Breadcrumbs to the face. 
Is it 27 degrees in your room? Come paddle around the cooling waters of the duck pond. Oliver, it's like spray water in your face or something. That'll make you feel better. Get yourself one of these, Oliver. Yeah, a nice fan, so you can fan yourself. Why are you crying, beauty? Tears of joy, Bermuda! Ooh, the joy of another duck in the duck pond, minecart gaping, mother ducker, damn, I know, yeah. you're already a mother ducker, welcome. Yeah, you see that. Minecart gaming, are you a fan of The Sims? Uh, do you play Sims? You played Sims 3, play Sims 4. We play other games other than The Sims, it's just currently Sunday is our Sims day. That's right. Minecart gaming, what is that a reference to? Like, where'd I you get your name? Probably. Minecraft? Minecraft? I don't know. It's not too many letters different, but uh, just. Well, I've clicked on his profile and I can see he has two blocky looking uh, character pictures. Mm. Yes, I am a fan of The Sims. Oh, very nice. Do you play any of The Sims yourself? Slayer Darth says, by the way, Bermuda undertook her studies at an American university, so she doesn't have a credible degree. Face Changer also did his, I believe, in an American uh, establishment. In a America? A America and America. Four from two hundred, uh, beauty. Nice. Can't wait for that. I two hundred. You get your uh, your your embossed card that says, "I'm a badass mother." I don't know. That isn't going to be a thing. Mm. <laughs> I did not have enough money to go to a private school. However, I was accepted to a private school oh, no but it was just it. way I mean you have to basically in indenture yourself into servitude for the rest of your life in order to afford some schools why? Your semi no, state he went to semi fluidic state is uh -huh. it like uh, a non Newtonian university non Newtonian fluid <laughs> <laughs> where's Josh oh, to screen cap either. this face But yeah, no, I went I went to a state university, and it's okay. It didn't have a very large um, enrollment, so um, like class sizes were small, and it meant that I got to spend a lot of like hands-on time with, for example, the NMR machine and other, you know, other equipment. Also, yes, my name was inspired by Minecraft after the item called the minecart. The thing that goes on rails. Okay. Well, you know, there are minecarts in other <laughs> games, and, you know, yeah. minecarts are a thing. There's so. a lot of them that are that. Everyone loves uh, fluid mechanics, so that's why we're talking about that. Shit. What's wrong, Oliver? Did you expect to have more breadcrumbs than that? Or is it that you're so far away from the 200 hours, Oliver? Beauty comes to a lot more of our streams than you do nowadays because I think you uh, you have a lot of busyness and you have to and you've had so He's many problems down with your computers school. and stuff like that. Yeah, he had computer issues and cracking down on school. Summer's coming though, Oliver. And Oliver has a lady friend too, so. Oh, that's awesome that you were able to help a startup get uh, some really good stuff going. Nice. Oh, it blew up just after you left. Oh, that's bullshit. Oh. Well, at least you have, you know, you can, you have the knowledge that you helped with something, and that's very satisfying. <laughs> hey, Minecart, are you a Minecraft YouTuber? Oh, beauty, come on. <laughs> no, it was Oliver who said it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you, you do make Minecraft videos, but you stream in Sims 4. Oh, oh that's cool. cool. We'll have to stop by and see you sometime. Phil, maybe Mein Kart is a reference to Hitler's Mein Kampf. Yeah, I'm completely sure that's what it that's what it is, Slater. I'm completely sure. I'm a hundred percent sure. Ollie barely does anything. He just stays home most of the time and he just sleeps. Literally just sleeps. Hey, and he plays Undertale or GTA. <laughs> <laughs> when Oliver isn't sleeping, he enjoys playing on Undertale on his phone and GTA. I don't even know Undertale is able to be that. You stream babies? Yeah, apparently you do. Mm. 
I think there was supposed to be a comma in there, maybe. I stream babies. No, I think he streams babies. Hey, yo, Free Cree, how you hey, doing? Hey, Free Cree, hi, nice to see you. Free Cree's one of our previous winners. You can see his victory portrait right there, this dude in the blue. So he lives in the fabulous Victor's Mansion across the street from this hell house of horrors. So that's hell where Free Cree lives. He's currently pursuing a career as an astronaut. I stream, babies. <laughs> oh. Ilsa the Ghost, welcome to the Duck Pond, Mother Ducker. Ilsa the Ghost, welcome to the, uh, the Sunny Ducks. You're our newest Mother Ducker. Come in and cool, cool yourself in the nice cold waters of the Sunny Ducks Duck Pond. You're not quacking chat, that's your ducks welcoming you in. Are you hungry? Red crumbs to the face! Hello, also, new Courtney. How are you doing? Minecart asks, how long have we been streaming for? Um, it's been about an hour and 40 minutes today, but if oh, you Oh, do you mean, mean like in total? Like, the very first stream we ever did was a little more than a year ago, so mm -hmm. we've been at it for, yeah, a little over a year. As a ghost, are you a friend? A person that enjoys The Sims? Are you here just to watch, or...? Other things like that. We do stream other games that aren't The Sims, but we do Sims on a Sunday. Yep, guaranteed. Thank you very to much see for following. Sims on Sunday. Yeah, we will make you into a Sim when we do a Sims creation stream. If you want, uh, all you got to do is fill out this Sims form. If you followed, it takes about five minutes, and it's something you can do if you've got two screens or are able to just listen to us while we're talking. Just open it up in another tab. What's this? Especially when your kids are fucking shitheads who would survive a non-private school. Bermuda, why wouldn't their parents get into debt for a shithead? He said Bermuda's a shithead. <laughs> Let me read that carefully. What are you trying to say, Slayer? Okay, I see. Yep. Mm -hmm. Have we too. been enjoying being a streamer uh, ever since we started? Uh, there's definitely been... When we very first started, it was incredibly slow. Uh, and generally during the winter months, things get quite a bit slow as well. Uh, generally, like viewer numbers stay all right, but then maybe drop a tiny little bit, and maybe uh, follower numbers seem to drop during the winter as well, because everyone's just feeling rubbish. Uh, but when it comes to summertime, generally things start to pick up again, so yeah, it's good. Yeah, streaming's We've only been fun doing when... it for about a year and yeah. a bit. Streaming's fun when there's a lot of people to interact with, when there's a lot of people coming by and enjoying your stream, so... You know, so otherwise you're good. just playing games and talking to yourself. <laughs> what are we doing right now? Uh, we're doing something called Big Brother's Bloody Basement, and what that is, is... If you've ever seen the TV show Big Brother, or very, very loosely seen the film uh, The Hunger Games, we are taking follower sims, which are sims that have been created from followers, and putting them in a house, leaving them for three days, and seeing who is the least popular uh, by clicking on each person and finding out who is the least liked of each person. Each person each person that's the least liked gets one vote for them. Whoever has the most votes gets sent downstairs to the basement where we have a painting gimp. There's a nice painting of them before they starve to death. Uh, yep, there's if you make it to the end of uh, Big Brother's house, you'll be moved into uh, Victor's house where we'll do a YouTube series of the Victors. Uh, so you'll get to see yourself if you manage to survive. If you want to be made into a sim and have your chance at making it through that, all you've got to do is click that follow button and then we'll send you a form for making a sim. So Slayer Darth asked us for some advice. He says his mother isn't in work at the moment. She's in her mid-50s. And I want her to work because I don't want her lack of an income and spending habits to whittle away my inheritance. Okay, what what are you actually asking? Because that's just a statement. Yeah. Uh, uh, Minecart Gaming says, when you started, what were the very first games you played? Well... We very, very first started, we did Sam, Sam and Max, Max But we only did it once, yeah, and there once. is no record of that stream, sadly, because yeah. I, would, I would just be personally interested in watching like yeah. how that went, because I remember it being horrible. 
we from then did some we did some pen and paper role playing games a little bit, uh, but we only did like we at that point we were only streaming it like once a week, and then we started doing some. Uh, well, like city skylines. Yeah, right? but what we did a lot of at the beginning and for a few months was Elder Scrolls Online. We did a lot yes. of that. I, I, that was like one of the first games that we started with that we did a lot of. <laughs> Hello, the tank again. New Courtney, welcome to the Duck Pond, Mother Ducker. Come in and cool yourself in the cool waters of the Sunny Ducks Duck Pond. You uh, hear that quacking chat? That's your ducks welcoming you in. Hungry breadcrumbs to the face. And here's Sunny Ducks. Generally, you don't have to, but like we check what we generally do is most everyone says quack quack to welcome the uh, new you know, followers in. It's a nice way of welcoming everyone. Old Deadpool, you back? Did you have to go somewhere? Or have you just been lurking all this time? Being inebriated is so much more agony and suffering, says Crollo. <laughs> You know how much rent in London is? It's, it's very expensive. Oh my god, fuck. You live in London? Rip. Also, hello, the tank. How are you doing? Welcome back. What have you been up to? How's your week been? Mine, minecart asks, do you guys live in the UK? I don't. I live in Iceland. Current, currently, I live in the UK. I live in the Wales. The Wales. Bermuda lives in Iceland. I uh, eat the Wales. He lives in the Wales. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Bermuda lives in Iceland, and she comes initially from America. Yeah, that's why I talk like an American. Talk that's like why I talk shit. like this! Yeah. Yeehaw, mother duckers. You're back. You went to live in London. Oh, I live in London. Oh, right then, let's see. Lots of people live in London. So, yeah, lots of people live in London. Hello, Connor Van Strangle. have mercy on their souls. Welcome back. How are you doing? Thank you for following us earlier. When do you intend to make more characters? Um, at present, we don't have a date Set in mind times. when we're yeah. going to do it. Because um, it kind of depends how many people uh, want characters made, how many people have submitted forms. And we only make characters of people who show up to the streams and are currently like in the chat when we're making them. Yeah. So, uh, generally it happens on a Sunday, so either we generally do a Big Brother's Bloody Basement stream on a Sunday, or we do character creation, or Big Brother's Bloody Basement and then character creation, or things like, uh, things like that. We do some Victor's House on a Sunday as well, some Mod House sometimes. Yeah, I mean, we guaranteed play The Sims on a Sunday, but... We could play it on other days of the week as well, and you know we don't just do Big Brother's Bloody Basement. Like Phil said, we do maybe mm. Victor's house over there, see what they're doing in that house over there, or sometimes <laughs> play with our mods household. We even have our own household, but we don't visit. We don't visit yeah, them don't very visit. often. We've pretty much fine. finished what we're doing with them, I think. Well, we did maybe some not. things with them, and yeah. you know whatever. It's like yippee yay, mother duckers! Mm. Ho ho ho! Now I've got a duck machine gun. But about Strangle, you can add songs to the song request, but we won't be listening to them now because this is a non-song request stream because it goes to YouTube. It is a uh, Sunday. It is Sunday today, yes. And Minecart says he lives in North Wales, so he said yes, Wales. So huh. Wales represent Welsh people are all over Twitch. Why is that? Dark Slayer six two four. Are you any friends or connection to Slayer Darth at all? Or is there just two people with Slayer names in the channel? Uh, so hello, welcome to the channel, Dark Slayer. I see you're probably a fan of The Sims. Oh, Slayer Darth continued about about his mother being out of work and all that. Anyway, mm. I just want to look into upskilling courses for my mother, who's 54 and a former school librarian, who is interested in horticulture, linguistics, family history, and literature slash copywriting. Phil, do you know of any upskilling courses in the UK she might be no. able to take? Nope. Don't know of any of them, mainly because I haven't looked for any of them. Yes, we do in fact have a YouTube channel, and you can follow us here. Connor Van Strangle is half Welsh. Does that count? That counts in us. Yeah, it's more Welsh than me because I'm not genetically Welsh whatsoever. Zero percent. Pure, purely English, but oh well. English and Armenian. 
Uh, and oh, you subscribe to a YouTube channel in the name of Cypher. Okay, thank you very much. That's cool. That's nice to see that that was you. Quack, indeed, Dark Slayer, oh. and welcome back. Hey, Mama, I'm on TV! On the YouTube TVs. YouTube is technically the new TV. Exactly, right? That's the thing. If you look at uh, percentages of people who watch TV and people who watch YouTube and things like that and like the age ranges, basically it's all it, only the older generations are really watching TV anymore. Most people are moving their way towards YouTube and it's basically just going to become the same as like people that listen to radio. Uh, yeah. It's only going to be a thing that happens in very small situations. Or like in the background because you know sometimes you'll go somewhere and there's like a radio playing in the background. So you might go somewhere and there's like a TV playing in the background like in a waiting room or you know something like that. So there's just something yeah. to look at. But it makes to me it makes a lot more sense to be able to watch the programs that you want to watch when you want to watch them instead of being like oh I've got to be home by 7 o'clock to catch you know exactly. blah 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 and then the next episode comes out in a week you know which is so why like... which is why there's definitely a downside to being on Twitch because Twitch has oh it's like set times that people stream generally yeah people can stream at random times and yes there's also like if you've got a big enough following and the following says hey I really think you should stream at blah 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 this kind of time right now then you could go, yeah, I feel like doing that. If enough people want to watch me stream right now, and you'll, you'll go and stream. Mom, I made it. Yes, thank you. You're, you're in the big time now. I'm a big kid now. Uh, Faith Changer says, uh, in New Zealand, uh, there's adult education at secondary schools and universities. Uh, YouTube or Netflix. Yeah, Netflix uh, is good because, yeah, there's that. But, like... Netflix, if everyone knew just how easy it was to uh, magically have things coming to your uh, computer without the need of Netflix, then probably most people would. But then it would probably get shut down much faster, so... Go on FIFA if you have it? You mean the game? You want us to stream FIFA? Neither one of no, us have it. No, I, I'm, not, I'm not very much of a FIFA fan either. I don't like football. Nah, what what does that make you feel old, Connor Van Strangle? Are you? Do you still watch TV? Don't say yeah, about your age, Connor. Yeah, don't. Con yeah. So we, I'm just going to quickly like do a tiny little purge of that. Yeah, it's no hard feelings, Connor. But we don't talk about age, no matter how old you are. No, Deadpool. No, don't do. It. God damn it! See, this is what happens. <laughs> it's like dominoes. We can't talk about it. Okay. This is a mature. The tank said I'm 74, so sadly I'm gonna have to purge you as well. <laughs> yeah, Jimmy. Jimmy knows. Like, no, stop talking about age. <laughs> uh, Op has three hours to live in game hours. I thought they revoked that rule. No, no. This stream is still listed as a mature stream. Yeah. So we understand that when you clicked start watching at the beginning of the stream, it's that all fine, was Connor. Don't worry about it. Consent that you are mature enough to watch the stream. We talk about some shit that children shouldn't hear. Okay, it's yeah. not a family-friendly PG stream. Nope. So just in case we like to not hear anyone's age, yeah. we'll we understand that everyone here is a oops. And now, now you shouted in caps. I didn't know. I'm sorry. It's I'm okay, sorry. Connor. It's Connor, fine. no hard feelings. It. It's fine. Like it's, it's you it's can a, stay here. We it's love a fun you. Okay? Thing. You you can say whatever. We, it was just a purge. It wasn't like we banned you forever or anything. Tank. <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> just stop. All right, we're not even joking around. Just quit it. I know. For as you could continue doing it, but then you know. It might turn into a banner because you know you've definitely heard. <laughs> God damn it, Tank! What are you doing here? Oh, there goes Op. There she goes. There she goes. It's just just the number seventy-four. You haven't said the word "I'm" or anything like that. It's fine. <sighs> Jimmy just said the number sixty-nine. He hasn't tried to say he is sixty-nine, so that's it's fine. Just a prank, bro. You guys should stream a multiplayer game like Rust so you guys can play together. Sometimes we do, Phil and I, play a game together mm -hmm. and stream it. Like I said, we started out doing a lot of Elder Scrolls Online, which we both played and uh, streamed it. We sometimes do Viscera Cleanup Detail, which is multiplayer. We play that. So uh, 
We do. We don't have the game Rust right now, but... If that yeah. exclamation mark, one, two, three, guys, you get to an enter the door giveaway. We do that every half an hour. Oh, Jimmy asked... This is the second time Jimmy has asked. I'm yes, sorry I didn't answer thing, you sorry. the first time, Jimmy. Who's in the house? Jimmy, it is a lot of people who we don't personally know because they came by the stream, they followed, they made a sim, and then we never saw them again. So it's a lot of strangers. It's a house of strangers. But I'll introduce you anyway. This is... You got to go, Connor. Okay, thank you very much for coming. Hope Good to see you next time, here. Connor. Yeah. Uh, this is Stacy Grove. The Twitch username was Cameron666, I think. Winter Knox is this sim. Right there. Simmer Boy, that's his sim. OP just died in the basement. I just died yeah, in the basement. It just, I, tonight. I, 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 like we had one we had one person that we know a lot and that person's just died. Sadly. Yeah, so we are really upset about OP's death. This alien is Shayla Bennett with a gorgeous afro and lovely abs. And somehow magically there's two of her wandering around somewhere. Yeah, she's got a clone. And this person is Amazing66. That we, we don't know this person. We don't really know any of these people. So yeah, Rip Boring House. Rip OP, I wish you had lived. But you didn't. There she goes. And there we go. As, as we like quickly go downstairs, we can see this happening. Oh, Deadpool, you didn't just spank someone, oh, did you? I'm getting spankings. <laughs> Pinky801, welcome to the Duck Pond, Mother Ducker. You're on your Mother Ducker, come in and cool yourself in the nice cooling waters of the. Oh, god damn it, Tank. Tank! The nice cooling waters of the Duck Pond. Uh, you hear that cracking in chat? That Shepherd Duck's welcoming you in. Also, you hungry? Breadcrumbs to the face. Uh, Minecart says, I finally found some entertaining streamers. We're glad to have you, Minecart. We hope to see more yeah. of you in the future. Glad to have you too, yeah. It's time to vote and see who's the next victim of the basement, however. Wow, wow, this, uh, this Stacy person has full relationship with two of the Sims. Like... This is some serious friendship going on. Hi, Pinky. I see you. Hi. Hello, and your welcome. name is Pink and everything. Beautiful. Are you someone that enjoys Sims yourself, Pinky? Yeah, do you watch a lot of Sims streams on Twitch? Do you play the Sims? Depends what it is, Deadpool. If you want to whisper it to, uh, to Sunny Ducks uh, first, and we can check it, uh, that's cool. Oh, you're with Minecart. Oh, cool. Nice. Are you like... Related or friends? Do you live in the same house or? Can I link a website? You want to tell us uh, about I, I just, it, Deadpool? Yeah, oh, I okay. just said I said whisper it. Sorry. There's a lot of Sims and play a lot of Sims. Yes, Ev everyone here loves Sims. We're all people that enjoy a lot of good Sims. I could hear birds singing every time you I'm talk. Sorry, I'm no, sorry. No, no. It's just there's it's too much lovely. beautiful nature out here in Wales. Oh, there's too much beautiful lush Welsh nature. While I'm going to hold my I've push got... to talk button and everyone can not say anything here again. No, no, it's fine. No. Oh, yeah. Listen to that bird song. It's like, it's like Wales is full of life and vibrance or something. And I've got... Beautiful sunny weather and like fucking howling wind coming off of the open sea and I'm like ugh 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 reiki reek. Is this a sci-fi story? I don't think that's what Pinky meant. I think she meant that she agrees with me by saying you two are entertaining streamers. Oh, oh okay. That makes sense. Okay. Oh, Titania's tired. I thought I was done, and then I remembered I have another memory card to edit. God damn it. Titania, have you stayed up all night editing these photos? Wow, wow. Everyone in this house is super friendly with everyone except Winternox. Nobody's really a big fan of Winternox. You just realize you have ducks as well. Bermuda also has ducks behind here as well. You can see it off in. Um, it's on a door over there. It's tiny. 
He's a lot further away. Yeah, it's further behind me, but I've got ducks. Pinky plays The Sims and yeah. watches The Sims. Pinky, have you played The Sims 3 or The Sims 2 or The Sims 1? Or have you only played The Sims 4? Just, I'm just curious. Yeah, you don't want to have multiple things. Uh, what, what? That's the Castro postcode. <laughs> okay, that's what? nice. Castro? <laughs> like Fidel Castro? Is he still alive? I haven't heard news of his death, but, you know, I know he's been unhealthy. Oh, nice. That's so cool, Titania. It's Sims mm -hmm. 3 and 4. Oh, you've both played Sims 3 and 4. Oh, nice. nice. You uninstalled Sims 4 and reinstalled Sims 3. You, you prefer 3 to 4, Deadpool? The Sims 3 has a lot going for it. it so definitely does. I could see you doing that. That makes sense. Yeah, I completely agree. Pinky's playing The Sims 3 right now. Well, that's cool. Do you like Sims 3 more because you're able to like make everything more like your, like how you want it because of all the colour palettes that you can change? You're at your mom's house that. and you're alive, Tove. Congratulations! Hey! Woo! Welcome to mom's house. And I'm glad you're alive as well. Have you submitted a, a Sims form, Tove? Have we got a form from you? Oh, that's true. He's a fever streamer. Okay. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Oh, look, look, look who's taking a bath. <laughs> You're playing Sims 5 New Zealand because the future there. It's only <laughs> one day in the future, and unless they release The Sims 4 in one day, uh, then I don't think you are. Face. We have a few people that uh, live in New Zealand and Australia. I know they're not the same place, don't get me wrong, I'm not saying they're the same place. But, but you're in the same that, amount of future. That, exactly, that you're basically are. in the same amount of future as us. The dishwasher has broken three times this season. And it ain't even over. We ain't even halfway through. Five to... if you're in 2017. Five! You need to change your Sims from what? But didn't we already make you, Jimmy? Um... Racist. <laughs> <laughs> Racist baby. <laughs> I think The Sims 4 has much better graphics than The Sims 3. It it does have graphical improvements. Um, yeah. But The Sims 3, it's really nice that you're able to, like, eyedropper a texture from something and make mm. it match another thing. I love that. Dine out? Ooh. You gotta go check out the trailer of what Sims 4 dying out. Okay, I'm gonna go check it out right now. The reader just have to hold on for a moment. Just hold on. I'm also playing The Sims 2 Million because I'm in oh, the future. Oh, you're in the future as well. Wow. Look at this topless dude doing sit-ups out by the grill. He's like, <gasps> yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Can you make your own fine dancey restaurant? No, dance, no, dancey. Fine dining restaurant. Maybe, maybe that's what about what it's about. You have toddlers in The Sims Three. Yeah, there are no toddlers in The Sims Four, which I think is kind of eh. silly, because you don't, don't go from being a baby to being a child. Yeah, but they're also useless. Uh, in The Sims Three, toddler stage is where you teach them to talk and walk and yeah. use the toilet. So they're useless. Everyone's useless until they can actually start going to school. Yes. Okay, so the the difference the difference is like. Am I playing this game to fully, truly simulate life? Or are you trying to, like, you know, play a game that's fun? Because those are two different things. Yeah, well, you know, people play The Sims for different reasons as well. And you can do different things. Babies? Baby rage. <laughs> yes. Um, yeah, there is an eyedropper tool in The Sims 4 to, like, copy an item, yes. But I mean an eyedropper to take the texture from something and apply it to something. So you could have like you could have a, a like bed sheets that match your sh Sims shirt or something like that, you know. Okay, that makes sense, Sarajanko. Sarajanko. 
Shut up, Phil. Toddlers are amazing. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll, I'll just be quiet for a minute. Yeah, the baby stage is more useless than the toddler stage. Courtney, I agree. Like, because the babies, all they do is shit and cry and eat. And it's like, you can make your sims, like, <laughs> come like... Yeah, well... Like, I don't know. It, it probably just depends on... You know, people have different opinions of them or something. That's fine, too. Don't worry about it. We understand what you meant when you said shit up. Just shit up! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even read it as shit up. I read it as shut up because, you know, that's what made sense to me. Uh, um, if he continues doing too many emotes, uh, we'll, we'll say to him now, please do less random emotes. Emotes add things to chat, but if it's just emotes, just for no apparent reason, then it's detracting and it's something we don't want to hear. Hashtag ban tank or unban tank? <laughs> you decide. All the babies just shit and cry and eat. Well, yeah, and like Looks in real life, are, right? yeah, in real life, I'm not really that taken with babies either. Like everyone's like, "Oh, babies, I want to cuddle them. They're so cute." And I'm just like, <laughs> "It's it's actually the human equivalent of a larva. That's what a baby is. It's just like a larva. It's this little chubby, grubby thing." And they just make noise, and they shit, and you have to feed them. I don't want to interact- it's like not even really a person, because you can't interact with it in a way other than just like, like, I don't know, holding it, I guess? <laughs> but once so they are so excited because the internet ran them. Oh, random yeah. Symbol spam. Yeah, because she didn't have very good internet where she was before, and now she's got better internet connection. Nice. Yep. But... I mean, children are a lot more interesting than babies because they can actually talk or, you know, have opinions about things, even if they are silly. Because, like, children can be really silly sometimes. Yeah, it's it's literally... Babies aren't symbiotic relationships. They're, They're parasitic. parasitic. Yeah. So puppies... Uh... Puppies are dog grub larva. Well, I don't, I don't know. Some animals, when they're born, they're a lot more into. But like puppies are not in that case because puppies are, when they're born, they are very helpless and their eyes aren't open and all that kind of thing. Hashtag puppies and babies aren't people. <laughs> <laughs> they will become people, but they aren't. I don't know. People have different opinions on that. That's fine. But that's how I feel. Like I don't know. Being a person means like being an individual, being like your own person rather than being, you know, fully dependent on another person. But you know, a parasitic. Mm -hmm. Baby's rights. <laughs> uh dunno. That's the word I was looking for. Oh. Oh, did Tank did Tank tell you to fuck off? Deadpool, poor... just ignore him, just S block w. him yourself, you know. Is, it, is that is that shit wanker? I don't shit know wanker? It's... Do you wank shit? Do you, how, yeah, how do you like, wank do you a like shit? Do you jack off a turd? That's or an interesting question. Do you use shit as lubrication? That's horrendous. That would be horrendous, especially if you have really gritty poop. Yeah, it's fine. You can just you can just let you know mute each other. Yeah, yeah. Just go ahead and do that. If it's if it's in a whisper, there's there's nothing I can see about it. So I, I'm yeah, we can't not verify do anything that. About it. Yeah. No. Nope. Bugs are animals, kind of. Oh, they are. They are. Because that's right, that's like the animal kingdom <laughs> includes insects. I don't know, biology. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's fine, Toei, you are right. Ah, uh, screenshots can be faked. Yeah, we're not going to take that as evidence. And like we said, you have the power to mute or block a person. So mm -hmm. just go ahead and do that if anyone's bothering you. And that applies mm -hmm. to anybody. If someone's bothering you, just mute them and block them. And move on. Defend your new favorite streamers. I'm glad you say that, Pinky. Aww. So, Pinky, tell us a bit more about yourself. Uh... Oh, Jimmy. Got some plane taking off a plane landing and then it just and then it just burns. We're not we're not uh, saying you're a liar in any way, Deadpool. Uh, we're just saying we we you know we're we not gonna take, take that any evidence. evidence. We're not gonna take any evidence, just just mute him if you don't like yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. It's nothing if, personal. If he starts Deadpool. if he starts being a dick in chat, like more than he is, <laughs> uh, we we will do it. 
so you can both stop talking about each other, yeah. just mute, mute each other and we're all good. Yep, yeah, let's not make this a thing. I have the power to kill people. Oh, I think I said that too loud. We all <laughs> have the power to kill people, isn't that kind of fascinating? Yes. Isn't that why people enjoy killing like small animals and insects too? Because it's like I have the it power. Makes you feel to do powerful. This. Yeah. yeah. You're in a marching band, thinking nice. Nice. What instrument do you play? I was in a marching band as well when I was in high school. We're not saying we don't believe him. We're just gonna stop reading your comments that have anything to do with that, okay? Yeah. If if you if you continue talking about this, we will. We will ban the person that's continuing to talk about this, so... Yeah, we're not having a discussion about it anymore. We told you what we think about the situation. Um, but in marching band, I played the flute for two years, which... <laughs> flute. Uh, it's not for me. Uh, and we had so many flutes in our band, too. Like, half of the band was flutes, which is probably a good thing, because you can barely hear them anyway. But then I switched to tenor saxophone. You play trumpet? Okay. Don't say what grade you're in, but... I, I don't know what that equals, yeah. so that's not saying an age. But yeah, try and stay away from talking about things that might reveal your age. Mm -hmm. Because this is a mature channel, so uh, everyone that's in here has selected the fact that they are 18+. plus. Mm -hmm. And as long as you don't tell us, uh, we don't have to ban you. But trumpet is cool. Trumpets are probably the most important part of a marching band, to be honest, or any band, because they're the ones that you can hear. These guys lost a follow here on YouTube. Uh, well, bye. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, uh, Deadpool. If you don't like the way we do it, we don't like to have people arguing in chat because it makes the chat shitter. So if people continue arguing, uh, that's that's their problem. It's like coming into someone's house with muddy shoes. You know, don't do that. Take your shoes off. Right? <laughs> Titania's done editing the other card. You report can't... us for refusing to do anything. That's not even a thing you can do. Yeah, sorry, Deadpool, it's not gonna fly, but, you know. 9,000 years old? Not yeah, talking about kinky. any form of age uh, is a thing, even if you're saying you're 9,000 years old. Uh, um, okay. You had to submit them on Dropbox today. Oh. Uh, or the ones you finished. Okay. You're triple 18. <laughs> okay, I'm going to quickly do a pitch of that one. Beauty, if you can one. keep your eye on age chat too, that would be a great. Thanks. He's probably playing some other games as well. He probably is, but you know, you're a channel mod, and at times, everyone needs a little moderation. Everyone needs moderation in their life. All right, I hate, hate Crollo Crollo Ball. Ball. Okay. <laughs> Just because of the eight ball. The thing is about like eight ball or asking questions in general. Don't ask a question if you're not prepared for any answer. <laughs> don't hate on Crollo Crollo Bot. Uh, home is Jimmy. We should hang out. It's mind numbing to be in the same room with people with so many lice. I can't tell how that's an insult, though. Yeah, that's kind of a nice thing. I mean, that's kind of like Crollo saying, like, oh, I hate being in the same room with people with so many head lice. You and I should hang out, because I can tolerate <laughs> your presence. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's kind of like a nice thing, right? Is it, just, is it being a, a bad thing because you're saying, like, you know, you have lots of head lice. That's the only <laughs> insult part of that, right? Tank, stop, stop, like, messing with Deadpool. I'm going to have to, like... We're going to turn this stream around, guys. I'm going to do a timeout of Tank uh, and probably a timeout of uh, Deadpool for now as well because you're both still talking about this and we said to stop talking about it. So I'm sorry, guys. You, sit you, on both, the naughty get, step for a while. you both get a 10-minute timeout. If you want to come back after that, that's cool. If you don't, I'm sorry. Yeah. If you want to press the unfollow and unsubscribe on whatever the hell you want, that's also cool. Like, we... We only we only want people around that want to want to have fun and be here for relaxing and things. If you if you want to start arguments, places, I'm very sorry. We don't want that kind of uh, thing in our channel. New Courtney says, "I hate being in the same room with people in general." Right, New Courtney? <laughs> exactly. I know that same feeling, New Courtney. People people stink. <laughs> people stink. 
people smell bad? I mean, unless you put, like, active effort into not smelling bad, people just naturally smell bad, and that might have been the self-defense mechanism that our species has to keep us from dying out. Because we don't have a hard shell. Our stink! We don't have a hard shell. We're not fast runners or fast swimmers. But you know. they can trace us with our stench. Yeah, but like we smell so bad that most animals don't want to eat us. So we're not hunted as food. Um, predators can kill us, but they generally don't hunt us for, as a food source because we smell and taste so bad. You promised me good cooking recipes, but my dog tasted horrible. Unsubscribe and unfriended. Enjoy your dog by yourself. <laughs> what the fuck is that, beauty? What does that mean? I think he's trying to say he ate his dog. Yeah, but like, it seems like that's like a quote from somewhere or a reference to something. Smelling. Yeah, people smell. We stink. Speaking of smelling and stinking, she finally shit herself so we can do her loser portrait. Yay! Oh my god, we were supposed to do intermission like 10 minutes ago. Okay, well. <laughs> oh god. Whoops. Okay, we're gonna do intermission. We'll be right back in a minute. Enjoy our screens and our intermission music. We'll be back in a minute. If you're watching on YouTube, thank you for watching. Please mm -hmm. like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. We put out a new video every day, so you'll get more ducks tomorrow. And see you soon. Yeah. <laughs>